Hello. Welcome. I am KP Carter, the Literacy Whisperer, and welcome to episode five of Become a Reading Rockstar. Today we're talking about our next part of speech, verbs. The reason I was doing all of that movement in the beginning is because we're going to talk about how verbs show action. Now, you know, verbs have more than one meaning. They can show action and they can also um, be show a state of being. But today we're going to focus on the action that a verb takes. That action that I was doing in the beginning was exercising. It's, well, actually stretching. So, you know, a sentence cannot be a sentence if it doesn't have a verb. So authors need verbs in order to write their books, in order to help you, the reader, understand what you're reading. So let's give some examples of verbs. Here's one. Sing. Lift every voice and sing. Okay, you don't want me to sing? Okay. Here's another action verb. Dance. <laughs> yes, I bet a lot of you out there are good dancers. Here's another action verb. Talk. We've been doing a lot of talking together. I've been doing a lot of talking. I'm sure that you are listening, which is also action. It's not actually movement, but when you're listening, that is an act that you are performing to make meaning of what's going on. Okay, so let's think about what are some verbs that you have, um, some actions that you've taken today so far, okay? Have you brushed your teeth? That's an action. Have you had a glass of water? Did you drink? That's also an action. Okay. Did you smile at a friend? That is an action. Okay, so I'm going to share something from this wonderful book called J.D. and the Great Barber Battle by Jay Dillard. I'm going to point out some verbs for you. Okay. Hey, he said when he checked out his hair in the mirror. Looks like Spider-Man's, he yelled out as he walked around the bathroom pretending like he was shooting webs out of his hands. So there's a couple of verbs in that sentence. Checked. He checked out his hair. He yelled. And he pretended he was shooting out the webs. All actions. Here are some more action verbs. Jordan, Eddie, and Xavier all groaned, but I laughed. Groaned. Ugh. That's an action. And laugh. <laughs> That's also an action. You would enjoy this book, I'm sure. J.D. and the Great Barber Battle by J. Dillard. So, verbs are vital. That means they're so important to what you read to help you understand what is actually happening. So, until next time, reading rock stars, I wish you love, laughter, and literacy.